The Arleigh Burke class of guided missile destroyers, the backbone of the U.S. Navy, could have been designed to be a lot more capable. But that didn't happen because of a dilemma. The dilemma of capability versus cost. The truth is, American shipyards can build better ships, but Congress doesn't want to pay for them. Which is why some key design elements of the Arleigh Burke destroyers were more influenced by budgetary watchdogs than naval engineers. Luckily for this class, the political pressures to keep down the costs arguably turned Arleigh Burke into the most successful and most produced destroyer since World War II. But why with all that success, the latest iteration of the class, the Flight 3, is the end of the road for the Burke class, is not what you think.